So suppose that four classmates are e splitting equally a $12 pizza that is half pepperoni, half veggie, uh, that somebody else bought them. So what's each person's fair share? Now, it's worth noting here that we're talking about dividing up pizza, uh, and other food products, but really we're using this as a metaphor for more complicated scenarios like dividing up assets after a divorce or dividing an estate, uh, or dividing up land after a war. Uh, but it's a lot more pleasant to talk about food, which is why we're framing this in terms of food. So, we're going to imagine we have a pizza with a total value of $12. Uh, we've got four people and they're sharing it. How much should each person get? It makes sense that we would take the $12, divide it over the four people, and each person is entitled to $3. That is what we call their fair share. Now, it's worth noting that fair share is in the eye of the beholder because we're talking about value here. And you can imagine that if this pizza were divided in half and is half pepperoni and half veggie, that if, you know, if I was a vegetarian, I would look at this and say, you know, this half is worth nothing to me, whereas this half has all of the value. And so, the question then becomes is, is how do we determine a fair share? So imagine that Steve here likes pepperoni twice as much as he likes veggie. So we can imagine then if we have our, you know, half pepperoni, half veggie pizza going on here, uh, and that, that, and he, the whole thing is valued at $12. How much does he value each half of this pizza at? Now you might be able to guess and say, well, let's see here, pepperoni's twice as much as veggie, and all together it's $12. So pepperoni would be $8 and veggie would be $4. Right, because together that's 12 and pepperoni's twice as much. Now, if you didn't just jump to that, uh, we certainly can pr bring in some algebra. We can say, I don't know how much this veggie's worth, but I know that pepperoni's worth twice as much, and if we put them together, they're worth $12. So 3x equals 12, divide by 3, x is $4, and so this side is worth $4, and this side is worth twice as much, is worth $8. So what would a fair share look like? Well, let's see. Let's imagine that each of these sides is cut into four pieces, just for simplicity here. So four pieces. So we got an eight slice pizza. How much is each slice worth here? So Steve would value each of these slices at $1 and would value each of these slices as $2 right, one quarter of the half. So if his fair share is $3, right, four, $12 divided over 4, there are several ways that he could get that. One would be three slices of veggie pizza. He would value that as $3. We could also give him one slice of pepperoni, and one slice of veggie, he would value that at $3. We could also give him one and, uh, a half slices of pepperoni, which he would also value at $3. So there's a lot of different ways of accomplishing the division here, uh, but the important thing towards a fair division is that Steve gets a fair share just like every other person who's splitting it gets their fair share.